Could I have another £20, please? <laughs> How many bottles of wine have you got in there? <laughs> no, 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 I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. But I'm glad that you laughed, because that's exactly what will happen if we lose trust. We'll ask to regain that trust, and people will just laugh at us. And how do we lose trust? Dead easy. Just follow my advice. Don't bother returning phone calls. Don't bother responding to emails or correspondence. Do not bother respecting people's time. Better still, make sure that they know that your time is more important than their time. Don't uh, deliver on a promise. Don't do what you say you're going to do when you say you're going to do it. But then again, we wouldn't do that. But there is one thing, and it's this. Whether, and it's shocking. Whether we do it on purpose or whether we do it by accident, to the customer, to them it's exactly the same thing. They're just going to think that we do not care. But there's a way of restoring trust. Speed. Now, I want to tell you a statistic.